afternoon, everyone. This is Melissa with the StockSwish.com, and welcome. Welcome to LLY Golden Gap. This is today is what is today? Today is Thursday, October third, third day of the month here, start to the fall season, and really earnings season hasn't started yet. There is some really nice uh, follow through today with bearish gaps to bigger targets. This really actually went to a much bigger target than expected here today. It really didn't work out right. Um, as far as big area last week to the dream target. Today it did. Today it did, and the market rolled over today, so it really held everything. I said the maximum level for this was 50-40-ish to go up to, 50-30, but I really wanted this to hold in the morning or open under 50. It didn't do it, but it did rally up. Um, very quickly here and then set up well as well and, and it broke and this is going to try to break the low of the day here now 4850 I mean this could go down to 48 this afternoon the market rolls over again here this afternoon the target on this is 48 it's already underway here now for the afternoon move it's ready set up to go so here was a move this morning, and I really thought 49 was the first target, which it was, which was realistic. But because the market kept rolling over, this fell and fell and fell and went all the way down to the next number, which was 48.50. Set up here again, and this set up here again in the, in the late morning. Stop has to be up here. If you did this in the late morning trade around the 10.45 reversal time, you're still in this second trade to get it down to see if it breaks the low of the day. Target even from here is a dollar. This morning, the target, uh, this morning was a huge play. A uh, huge play if you did this this morning at the correct placement. You would have had to very, very aggressively do this out of the gate. And it held, like I said, a number that wasn't ideal, but was a number, so it worked. The better setup in this was after it started to try to go and couldn't, and then it tried to rally back and couldn't and broke. So the move here, really from here to here, was the play. Whether or not you would have stayed in this whole thing or not, who knows, but this was the exit, double bottom out, also way past any number you could have even possibly ever figured you'd have. Um, ideally, this worked actually beautiful today. Uh, Lily sometimes can be whippy and spready and jumpy. Today it really behaved very nicely. It got the momentum into it, broke down, and if you didn't do the first aggressive play or the second aggressive play in this, you actually missed the whole move and didn't have any entry. There was one aggressive play in this in the morning and a second aggressive play in it right after the fact, and that was it. This move that, that's happening here is a very, very late move, and I typically do not like to trade in the afternoon anyways, but you could have done this here. I mean, you very well could have done this here and taken this trade to get it on down simply because of the overall weakness of the day. And this isn't going to go anywhere like retracing itself against itself today. The stock will close looking very similar to this today. It may have some kind of little tail here, but this is going to hold 80% of this bar today because this is broken now. And actually, you know, the bigger area on this, I think, is even under 47. So this should, this might even fall through immediately tomorrow, despite the bar today. This is one of these weird ones where you look at it and you say, you could actually go a second day into itself. Hard to believe here. I, I think this could fall a second day on top of itself. We'll see where it closes today. I, if, it, if this breaks 48 today, it's going to fall on top of itself again tomorrow. Again, beautiful follow through, nice continuation. This chart has been lower and was lower. I, I didn't like the fact that it didn't work out right last week. This was a short last week. It just was really, really choppy to play. Today it's situated itself and settled down and is now doing it. So this is LLY, a uh, really nice move here today with Lily. And if you played it today, you should just be done. This is a fantastic move, had a beautiful move in it today and really went to at least the dream target from where it opened today, um, it did go there. Possibly 48 this afternoon if you do trade the afternoon and you'd already have to be in it. There's no entry here now. It's past the time. There was two entries. It's late. But this is still going. We'll see where it goes. And even if this just rests here and pitters out the rest of the day, this is still a watch for follow through possibly in the next week to get to some bigger swing trade targets. Really nice gap today in Lily. Golden Gap, if you're interested in more information on the upcoming gap class and learning how to rate gaps and read gaps and determine if this gap was over 20 points, which it was, you can email me at melissa at the stockswish.com. My next class upcoming date will be October 12th and 13th. If you're interested for the gap course, it's a two-day course. Email me at melissa at the stockswish.com. Thanks, everybody. Have a great day.